man. Too much shit, man. Ain't no way I can sit back and just let this shit flow out there like this, man. Shirt this motherfucker, man. If I you a blunt up, smoke with me right fast. You know what I'm saying? Roll you up a doobie, motherfucking. Roll you a motherfucking. You know what I'm saying? Here we go again. You know what I'm saying? I got plenty of battery. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to let everybody get in here first. So soon as I get to a K, I'm gone. Soon as I get to a K, I'm gone, man. Listen, if you're going to get on my live telling me to get off and do all this other shit, man, you can say your comments, man. You know what I'm saying? Now you know what? Drop that shit, man. This shit ain't gonna do nothing but go on out the roof. That's what I needed to do. Uh-oh, there go four. Give me a band, man. I ain't joining nobody. Let me clear my name first. <clears throat> Alabama, Mobile, Birmingham, Montgomery. Oh, yeah. Come on here, man. This enough for my fans right here. This at least half on. Um. <coughs> so I'm gonna get started, bro. I told y'all yesterday <coughs> I was gonna speak on this honeycomb situation. So boom. Once honeycomb dropped the disc, I'm upstairs, I'm in the room, I'm laying down. <laughs> All I heard is Trey. I come out the hallway. I look down the steps. He like, check your DM. He sent the song to me. I sent, bro, three paragraphs about Honeycomb, bro. I sent him three paragraphs, bro. And I already got the screenshot. He can try to go on there and try to delete it or whatever, woo, 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 whatever. You know what I'm saying? That's why at the end of the day, I said, I don't want to see him hurt. I don't want to really... I don't want no blood from him. This way. So I go over bro house. You know what I'm saying? I walk in. He in the trans. You know what I'm saying? Sugar looking crazy. She don't know why he looking crazy. This, 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 this getting to him. You know what I'm saying? Because he know he wrong. I knew, I knew what happened. I knew how it went down. You know what I'm saying? But a nigga really used me as a pun. You see what I'm saying? I didn't really know how, bro. I ain't really know how bro really felt about me Cause he don't talk to nobody He be in the room He come out He smile He fake He just He just He just gonna He just gonna show somebody He not But then when he get behind the closed doors And he get up under female All look Get the coming out of it You know what I'm saying There it go There go a K So boom We in the kitchen man You know what I'm saying We talking about it I'm like, bro, you respond to that man, bro. You're going to make that man a star, bro. You know what I'm saying? He trying to keep the internet. He on the internet. He just came home, this, that, and the other. He still currently crying, woo, 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 this, that, this, that, and the other about it. So, shit, he was like, man, bro, I'm finna just go on, man. Let you go at this man ass. You know what I'm saying? He been doing so much crying and I'm already on one because I'm just turned anyway because I'm going through shit every day. So I don't give a fuck. You know what I'm saying? So this what happened. I gave him my phone, bro. He got on Instagram, bro. You hear me? And started writing stories. Now, last night, there was me at Honeycomb. There was me telling him to meet me and get my one-on-one. -on -one. There was me typing. But I want to clear my name out about that grandma shit, fool, because my grandma dead, fool. You hear me? I bury my grandma, my fool. Man, anybody on here that know my mama, that know Roslyn, that know plural, like, I bury my grandma. Rick was in jail, bro. I was in high school, bro. They came and got me out the class and told me, hey, your grandma's funeral is this much. You know what I'm saying? We need you to give us that money. And my mama was looking at me like, son, you the one that got the money. You know what I'm saying? So, Man, I, I know, you know what I'm saying, this damn near gonna take damn near at least more than half of it. But, you know, this is where we at right now. 
Man, this is on my grandma, rest her soul, bro. Riley Jean have to rest her soul, bro. I paid for my grandma funeral, bro. I put my mama in black, bro. I held my family, bro. Rick was in jail, bro. You hear me? I'm standing over my grandma casket, bro. It's rubbing her hands, bro. Hands cold. She still got her rings on, bro. Bro on the phone, like, bro, how she, how she looking, bro? I'm like, bro, she got makeup on. She don't like makeup. You know what I'm saying? My grandmama raised me, bro. Little you, my little sister, them folks stayed with me. Them folks stayed with my mama a lot because they was more, I don't know, like my little brother and my little sister stayed with my mama a lot of their years. I stayed with my grandma majority of my life. You know what I'm saying? If I went at mama house, you know what I'm saying? Rick in and out doing time, going over here, living over here, doing this other shit, robbing motherfuckers, doing all this type of shit on his own. Just I'm trying to discover life, just trying to want to be a gangster type shit. So, boom, uh, back to the situation. Cause like I said, bro, my grandma dad too, Kong, you hear me? I ain't never been no nice ass nigga fool to try to explain myself or try to make a reason to why I didn't win at a nigga ass fool, but I can't sleep fool knowing that what that what, what what was said on that story about your grandma and them, bro, that man typed this shit on my phone, bro. You hear me? That's on my dad grandma, bro. Rest her soul, bro. When he posted it, I ain't feel it, bro. You hear me? I could have deleted it, fool, but I'm telling y'all now, fool, because I feel like I've been played on, fool. I feel like a nigga used me, fool. Like, nigga don't even fuck with me. Nigga don't care if I got no security out here of a nigga. If a nigga flush me out here like these facts, bro. So one of my little niggas, fool, I ain't gonna need to address him as no little nigga, fool. Like, cause we around, we about the same age, fool. That my a real nigga, fool. He a round cone, fool, you hear me? Man, that man ain't tell me, fool. That man ain't said, listen, fool. Man, cone, like, he don't want no problem with you, bro. Like, he said, you a real nigga, bro. Like, he fuck with, like, what type of time you on? And, and, and I'm like, okay, by him saying that, when, when I'm over there at Bruh House, and Honeycomb must have just said it, because I don't go on lies, bro. Everybody know this, bro. I don't go on lies. I don't look to see what niggas say. I don't watch comments. I don't tag niggas into comments. I don't do that, bro. You hear me? Man, bro, grab that motherfucking phone and tag Honeycomb and say some shit to him. Honeycomb responded immediately. He happy his head. Here he go. I got him, bro. I got him. I'm telling you, bro. I know how to do this shit. I know how to do this shit, bro. I got him. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to go let you go live. Let you go and turn up on him. This going to shake you in. I'm going to give you the chain and I'm going to sign you. That's on my dead grandma, fool. I'm Riley G. Help to rest her soul. You hear me? Real talk, bro. I could have got on here and said, bro, I don't give a fuck who died, bro. My grandma dead, too. Nah, bro, that shit hurt. That shit hurt. I know how you feel, bro. You hear me? You know what I'm saying? My grandma in the hospital, bro. My grandma went down three times, bro. My grandma died three times and came back, bro. When she went to, when they released her out of the hospital, bro, she had a seizure at home, bro. Had to go back to the hospital, bro. When they released her at the hospital and sent her to the old folks' home, she wanted to get out the bed so bad, bro. She ended up falling off the bed, hitting the floor, bro. We down and still got a lawsuit for that woman deal, bro, from them people, bro, but never pursued it, bro. Our shit been fucked up, bro. Our grandma is all we had, bro. My grandma caught the bus to work every day, bro. I'm the nigga that's coming down our apartments running, knowing that she get off the bus about 3.34. I'm standing at her bus stop, at the matter bus stop, waiting on her to get off. So when she get off with these groceries, I can help walk her back to the house, bro. Real talk, bro. And that's on my mama, fool. If a nigga spoke up under my grandma fool and I felt like he did it on oh, Jesus, I wanna kill him too. But I gotta give you that, bro. I can't let you, I can't, I can't continue on with you thinking that I said I wanna put you where your grandma and them is, fool. You know what I'm saying? Because, bro, if I wanted to, bro, I would have made sure I had me a bike out there with them niggas, bro. You know what I'm saying? I could have went and, yeah, fool, I could have went and got, yeah, fool, and nah, bro, you hear me? Nah, bro. <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? That's a that's a lose lose situation. That's like suicide. But if I beat your ass and I record and I record this shit, I'm gonna hurt you worse than killing you. Fool, you got to live and see this shit for the rest of your life. Your sons, your kids, your mom. Man, I ain't play with no love. That might fap the nigga ass up. 
Win, lose, or draw, bro. You hear me? Yeah, fool. That's what happened, fool. You know what I'm saying? So, to be real, fool, like, I look at, I look at, I don't look at, like, these four ops. I'm really in the situation at the moment. Like, these my brothers. I been wrong. They been wrong. Let's make it right. But the whole time, nigga never gave a fuck about me. You hear me? I'm finna tell y'all something else. I'm gonna give y'all this right here, too. Bro, when I came home from jail, bro, this on my grandma, bro, on Roslyn, bro. Rest her soul, bro. I ain't even know who Pooh Shots did Big 30 and them was, bro. Tell me I'm trying to slide on Big 30 and them, trying to get you to do, probably did do some shit like this. Cause me and Big A, bro, bro, when I did Big 30, bro, I didn't even know Big 30, bro. Never talk to him. See, motherfuckers gonna tell me I'm crying and I'm still on here. This is what they don't want me to do. They want us to, they want us to kill each other. You know what I'm saying? I don't even want to say that word on these lie. They might, you know what I'm saying? But bro, them folks want to see her. Yeah, fool. You see what I'm saying? Them folks hold both our families cry, bro. If you really want to know the answer. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, bro. You know what I'm saying? So I didn't even know Big 30, bro. I did Big 30 just on the strength of him calling me, telling me to do this shit, bro. He's sending me out every time, fool. Then it might come home for it like he don't know me. So, I was mad at, at, at Big A on some whole other shit. Like, it's different things that I just was feeling away about Big A about. Not that I wanted to hurt him about it, but I never got my answer. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, I was in that mode then when Big A came around. Fuck a nigga. I don't give a fuck. It, it, it could have been anybody, fool. He came around at a bad time, fool, where niggas didn't fuck my trust up. You know what I'm saying? So, once I start seeing niggas make little mistakes and shit like that, I'm judging them to the max. You see what I'm saying? Especially if you talking about being in a position next to a motherfucker that's finna help feed our family, bro. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy how shit work because... Man, the devil, uh, the devil uh, uh, make some shit happen just so he can react and go back the way it's supposed to go because it wasn't meant for me. I'm riding because my brother at the end of the day. I don't give a fuck. He's right or he wrong. I know you remember that day. It was, it was. I know Honeycomb and Rick remember this. Honeycomb, the spider nigga from Louisiana, uh, Tech. Me and Honeycomb, all us on, on live, on four-way. I had Jay Kane home doing my first time ever seeing Honeycomb or Tech. I'm not on the phone. I'm on the phone. I ain't saying nothing. So, bro, like, y'all, this is my little brother. Woo, woo, woo. He just kind of home and shit. So, I'm, I'm asking, bro, on the, on the, uh, the four way. I'm like, who is that? I'm pointing at Tech. I'm pointing at uh, Tech. And I done bumped into Tech again. Tech, a real nigga. You know what I'm saying? Spider. So, I'm like, bro, who is that? He like, bro, this tick, bro. You know what I'm saying? Woo, 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 woo. He like, y'all, excuse my little brother, man. He just kind of home. He don't be on his internet shit like that. He don't be watching him. He don't, you know what I'm saying, bro? I follow zero people for two, three years straight, bro. On my mama life, bro. I follow zero people. Like, because that helped me focus better. I like to read, bro. I like to, I, I like to learn myself, bro. I like to be creative, create clothes and, and write music. And that's the type of shit I like to do. You feel me? So, I don't really too much be too deep into the internet shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? So, this what's going on, bro. Like, with the Big 30 shit, by him saying that, man, bro, that man said he'll fuck around and get you killed. When Honeycomb said that, in my heart, I believe him. You know what I'm saying? When Big A, now, now, that, now that when Big A told me why we on a three-way, when it was up and we got on the phone, he said, bro, I'm not the reason you not around your brother, bro. I want to see you out together, bro. I want to see you with your family, bro. You that man, bro. I understand it, bro. On my mama life, bro, my grandma, bro, I thought that man was lying, bro. Now, it's a lot of other shit that I, you know what I'm saying? But with that one situation, now, now I kind of believe him. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, bro, I ain't got you. I ain't got... This man holding his nuts on you, bro. Like, bro, what you mad at me for? But he playing motherfuckers against each other. You feel me? This shit ain't straight. You making him think, I don't fuck with my little brother. I'm telling you, bro, I ain't, I ain't nothing with him, bro. Then you fucking around. Then you tell this nigga, you, then you tell Big A, you a fucking around. Like, right, fuck him, bro. I get him up out of here. So, boom. 
Then what happened, bro? When he said I won for this gang and I supposed to win live about Boogie and all this and all this shit like that, woo doo doo woo. When that man came home, bro, that man would not call me, my mama. He signed a deal. We watched all this shit. Like, he wasn't talking to nobody. You see what I'm saying? For a long time. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, where I was getting it. So, yeah, I had pulled up on him. Big A was out there, you know what I'm saying? So, we had the mall tie video shoot. Uh, the joint, uh, the back end joint. Did what happened, bro? The man wanna call me, say nothing, nothing, for we was up. You hear me? It was up. The man wanna call me, he wanna say nothing to me. But it's up on the internet. You know what I'm saying? I, I sneak feel away toward Big A, too. So, um, we at the studio. I mean, my, my little nigga from Minnesota, fool, he, he got in touch with Bacon. Bacon Maltai, who sat out Bacon real tall, real nigga, bro. So, he linked up with Bacon to do him some promotion shit. You know what I'm saying? We pull up at the restaurant and meet him. My little nigga doing a promotion. The nigga see me. So, the nigga see me, the Bacon nigga see me. He see me with the f g chain on. He finally look at him, cause you know I'm all way, you know what I'm saying? I'm hooded, I'm all way mad. Niggas don't know who I am, but this time I just got the hood on, my chain hanging. Like, damn, you finna, brother, he trying to prove to me that this is, that my, he be texting my brother, this, that, and the other. I ain't finna make a long story, make a long story short. So, boom, Bacon end up hitting me up, finding out I'm his brother, he listen to my music. Bacon like, man, this young nigga banging. Long story short, he like, man, I'm finna get, get you in touch with my a and &R. I get in touch with the a and r a and r tell me about 10 o'clock at night, pull up to the studio. I'm in the street by myself, bro. So, boom, I pull up to the studio. The nigga, like, soon I pull in the gate, the a and r nigga jump out. He like, hey, bro, you fuck with your brother? I'm knowing down where it is up right now. You hear me? But in my mind, I'm, I'm thinking, bacon and put it together for me to come here, for this nigga here to take me to my brother. So he like, you fuck with your brother? I'm like, yeah, I fuck with him. That's my brother, man. Come on, man. We don't let nothing. He like, all right, well, follow me. This something don't nobody know. I never went live and talked about this. He like, all right, follow me. So I'm following him. He take me to the video shoot in Houston. He take me to the video shoot. Man, I fuck them folks' head up, bro. You hear me? I pull up in the charger, jump out the joint, walk straight up on him. Big A stepped in front of me. He was like, bro, listen, bro, this your brother, bro. Don't come out here with that, with that, with that, with that, with that, the crazy, the crazy shit, bro. shit. Talk to that man, like, that a man, man. like a man. So you know, so you know, talk to him. Talk to him. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. I'm standing behind him, I ain't seen my brother in five years, 